Howdy, howdy, and how do you do? And welcome back because today is a round drill speed run kind of day. I don't think I've ever speed ran with the round drill, so we'll see how that goes. I kind of felt like today's the day we're going to see success. You know, I think bombs are going to help us. Oh, uh, well, blind, blind, every turn's good, but I think bombs are going to be a little bit quicker for the speedrun aspect. And I don't think you, you don't start the timer. This is going to be the sped up version because I don't want to do the base, base game one. As soon as I throw this first orb, then away we go. Oh, now we kind of sit back and relax. The day is done for me. It's actually very late whenever I'm recording this. I definitely uh, did not plan out my recording schedule too well. And now I'm a few uh, days behind here, but not a few days behind, but I'm recording pretty last minute, it feels like. But. I think it'll be all right. It's kind of a race against the clock here. I really wish I didn't hit that bomb there. But I think us hitting this, it's going to be perfect. I think taking the elite fights are going to be their better bet. Here. Ah, shoot. We're not taking the elite fights. We're hitting the shop instead, which is fine. Force of stones, fine. Question mark is fine. We don't need elite fights. We just need question marks. Question marks are going to be the speed. Terrible throw. But the race is, do I get this video done before my wife gets home? She's only working a six hour shift tonight. And so just destroyed a lot of bombs there, which is not great. Which, she doesn't know that we have a channel yet. I know, I keep, uh, just don't know when I should tell her about it, but I'm wanting to get this recording done so I don't have to kind of explain to my to her what I'm doing and especially why I'm still awake. <laughs> she will want to watch a movie or something because she works night shift, so this is around the time she's like wide awake still, especially since she's only working half a shift, half of her normal 12 hour shift. So she's gonna probably be full of a little bit more energy than I have in my tanks, since I am not on the nocturnal schedule. Well, kinda now I am if I'm playing games, right? Puts me onto that schedule. Honestly, I feel like we're doing pretty good. First half under three minutes. Well, we're not through the first half yet. Maybe we should have waited to throw that. Our, uh, who well? Uwella Deville. We can hit one more bomb here and then we'll be good. Actually, that works. Uh, I think we upgrade stone and move on. We don't have any pierce which is going to be kind of frustrating for us. But I think we should be relatively fine. Hmm. I think not having Pierce against this boss is definitely going to be a little bit of a oversight for us, but we should be fine. Just going to take up a little bit more time to get through this fight. Oh no, I gotta skip here. Makes more sense to skip than it does to actually play that one out because if we played it out, he would have done a hit and run and we would have postponed this fight even longer. Just keep upgrading our stones, get that fully upgraded. And then we just grab Molten Mantle. And then we away we goes. Honestly, this is going pretty smooth, if I do have to say. I think we wanna go. Come on. Continue. I didn't even look at the map. We'll go left. Uh, upgrade all stones, please. Let's so throw the Matriarch guy here. Let's look at the map. Yes, this is the way to go. 
I think honestly going down this way is gonna be the way. Just take on the normal fight. Uh, I took on the elite fight. Maybe I should have took on the normal fight, but. Well, Shaker's fine. Uh, enhanced gunpowder is what I chose. I think that's an all right guess. Bomb baton's perfect. Bomb baton's actually going to be very good for us. Ground guard's good. Oh, yeah, we didn't really necessarily need that. That would have just ate up more time. I skipped the cookie. I skipped the relic. Ah, uh, the pressure's getting to me, ladies and gentlemen. The pressure is getting to me. I don't know what I was thinking there, but I skipped the relic. A cookie, nonetheless. One that will heal us on a consistent basis. Which is quite annoying, the fact that we did that. Well, that works. I'm eating too much time deciding there. Especially whenever I decided on nothing. Um, I, f I don't even know how to commentate with this one. This one's full of all kinds of a little bit more than I anticipated or round drill to go. I think there's a few mistakes that I've made throughout this run, but overall, I'm not too disappointed with it. I mean... Well, it's kind of faster to skip, to be honest with you. At least it appears to be- Oh, this is going to be the fight that just ruins our whole streak now, isn't it? Because we can't- Oh, the molt mantle doesn't really help us here. We don't have any pierce. I came and get over to the bombs. There's one bomb is fine. I think throwing the Mad Three Orphka here will be good. They're still alive. How much life does this thing have? Which granted, we're not doing any damage whatsoever. We are lacking there of damage. I can't hit the refresh. Well, that works. A blind is fine. Push mark. Blind will be good. I believe. We don't really have a way to heal. I wasn't expecting that to just... Finesse its way around everything there, but it did. The cookie would have been so good, because that would have been a form of healing. Especially with the red bombs, I kind of forgot red bombs are a thing. We have no money. So we need to take elite fights to hopefully postpone any of... Perfect. I think that's plenty of damage. Dang it, it's not. Aw, uh, Augur. Call me crazy for going for more bombs, but I think bombs are going to be better. Tactical treats, okay. It's not the bomb final boss, is it? Because if that's the case, we might be actually screwed. No, it's the dragon. Dragon's good. All Augur's not fantastic against it. Matry Arpshka against the dragon is actually pretty OP. We have zero healing. 
A lot of red bombs getting hit. We just gotta hope we don't get the red bomb fight. A random orb. Oh, shoot. That's a lot of health. Gone. Come on. Not a fight. Not a fight. Oh, this fight's fine. There's no red bombs in this fight, which makes it good. Perfect. He's now... Oh, the dragon. How are we going to one-shot this dragon? We essentially have to one-shot the dragon. We have no health. Come on, Matriorbska, Matriorbska. Perfect. Starting with the Matriorbska. Get the perfect throw. No, you went down the side. You went down the side, Matriorbska. We are losing. We lost. Oh, we were on pace for such a good run. I'm still uploading this one because that was such a good run. And just know we could have had it. We just made too many mistakes. We didn't have enough damage for that invisible. The invisible fight hurt us. All the red bombs hurt us. Oh, that was such a good run. The cookie could have saved us a little bit, gave us a little bit more healing. So that is on me. Granted, I don't think it would have gave us too much of a game changing. Yeah, we lost by one health, but our refreshes are in kind of poo poo spots. But I don't know. That was exciting. Riveting. Maybe we'll try it again. Maybe we'll try it again. But that was a good one. Thank you so much for tuning in. Short video, but it was supposed to be world record but it was probably pretty close no i think world record's like eight whenever it's the sped up version eight minutes or something like that which i could see it happening if i played a little smarter made a little bit more quicker decisions but it is what it is thank you so much and i look forward to talking with you all later Bye bye